true self versus the false self. What is it? Or is it perhaps even another illusion from the mind? So let's explore this very fascinating concept as well. Because I already made quite a few videos about you know, the true self and the true self is where you want to be and stuff like that. So let's uh, first talk about the false self. So when we think about the false self, we probably think about um, you know, someone who's very obsessed with creating his perfect self image, right? That wants to have it all, that wants to show to the outside world how perfect he or she is. That he has it all together, perfect career, perfect relationships, the perfect car, the perfect house, you name it, right? So uh, the false self is very obsessed with fame, success, status, recognition, validation, um, wealth, rewards, you name it, right? And yeah, okay, that could be, <laughs> it could be, um, but that depends. It also depends like, hey, from what kind of place are we coming from, right? Are we coming from this place like, um, you know, we are so externally focused because we are so freaking scared to actually dive within? Is actually also being able to connect with our inner self, right? The soul, the spirit, and then create a healthy balance from that? Or are we kind of suppressing that part within ourselves? Because we, we feel so empty within ourselves. And that's something that you know we do not wish to feel therefore we have built up many many walls um, you know in order to not to feel that and just focus on building this perfect self-image for ourselves so it kind of depends right where we're we actually coming from are we coming from fear or are we coming from love and inspiration so then what exactly is the true self um, because personally I experienced this a lot in my personal life um, is always having this this feeling of emptiness and loneliness and isolation within myself and I also felt like during my life I kind of built up a couple of walls because I did not want to get in touch with that um, so I was much leaning into this side let's say called toxic masculinity that I really wanted to show to the world what I was able capable to do right having success recognition validation and that sort of things so I was really leaning to that side very very much and I didn't really care that much what had to happen as long as I could you know get my image right then the true self i already spoke about this quite a bit the true self is where we are really coming from you know within right where we can experience more unconditional love for ourselves more joy more empathy and compassion for ourselves this is kind of like where we start to purify or cleanse our spirits right it's like when more light love consciousness can you know flow in our own glass of water it can purify it can cleanse it and that eventually can you know start to flow over um, and that's where we like to identify people as authentic maybe right they are authentic because their actions are in line with who they really are right there's like a beautiful alignment with a lot of things between the state of being their actions and you know that's what they manifest so now of course the question like okay so you know the false self is only obsessed with wealth fame and recognition but if i want to be my true self i cannot have that because that's related to the false self or whatnot so maybe i should you know shame myself or guilt myself if i want these things no of course not that's not really the case because again i always spoke about you know it depends from what kind of place you are coming from are you coming from fear or are you coming from love where you have indeed have created a beautiful alignment with you know your your inner being your actions are coming from a place of inspired actions and of course with that also comes the beautiful things that you know you're not really so longer obsessed with with attaining or getting or you know having but that just come and you know you're okay with them having and you're also okay with not having it so then of course the question is there actually a separation between the false self or the true self and the truth is in my experience is that you know what it's actually all one you know all these things is, exist inside of us right it's all part of our consciousness it's all part of a very complicated network of the mind so the real question is of course like hey you know 
to which part are we leaning to the most right i mean our rainbow has many colors are we going to the dark side of the color of the rainbow or are we going to the light right and can we also find a middle ground between it so that's really the question so the so it's not really about you know dividing things up from ourselves or creating separation like this is bad this is evil and this is good right because it exists all of us right and it works together in a very synchronized way so it's more about learning to accept it embrace it that we have all these beautiful aspects and not um and i think that's a very important one in order to overcome you know your feelings of shame and guilt that you might have about oh you know if i focus on that then i will be you know going after my false self right because now i'm obsessed with success and whatnot no it's not really about it you can still have that of course you know when you really come from your inner being that really you know wants to give and wants to serve and you know wants to show your authentic um, you know your authentic self and what you truly believe in so it's really about you know getting more in touch with your inner self um, and that eventually can you know start to flow over to the world where you want to you know be of service in a very inspiring way and then again you know you can still have these you know beautiful things um, that life has to offer but not so much like oh you know I need to have that I need to get that in order to have this you know perfect image and whatnot so now of course the question um, yeah what did you got out of this this was this a new insight what are your ideas about this feel free to leave a comment below and let's discuss further um, you know hopefully it's helpful and I see you in one of my next videos take care for now Bye-bye.